Hi darlings, welcome back. Another day, another Black Friday or Cyber Week, I should say, uh, sale, edit, haul video for you. So today I was actually planning on this video being a come online shopping with me because I have known for a little while that today would be the day that the net porter sale launch and I will definitely be doing some online shopping. So the come online shopping with me is going to be the second half of this video but because so many of my favourite retailers from the high street also launched their sales today, I thought I would also do a bit of a top picks from things that I've either just ordered or already have in my wardrobe because you guys have been really enjoying that um, kind of setup in yesterday's video and ones before that as well. So just super quickly before I show you the best things that you should be buying today in the Cyber Week sales, just a little reminder that every single day at 8am I'm sending out a newsletter which contains all the very best sales that you should be shopping as well as my edits of the top picks. It just makes it super duper easy for you and it means that you're the first to know about the sales. And for the full list of sales, make sure to head to my blog, fashionmumbler.com, because I have my Black Friday hub there, which is literally every single sale listed, as well as a few edits, because it can be so overwhelming. Like, for example, yesterday, oh my goodness, when Selfridges launched their sale, it was massive. So many amazing things, including the Chloe test bag, even GHD style, the um, Royal Dynasty pink ones, which I love, Prada bags, it was incredible. There's still a lot left in stock too, so I will leave my Selfridges edit linked down below, as well as today's Netta Porter edit. So everything that you need will be linked in the description box, including what I'm wearing now. My jewellery, this is from the Monica Vinader collection, and it is currently 30% off, actually everything. So I've got the matching necklace and bracelet and then my little earrings are from the Caroline Issa collection. So that is 30% off. Links in the description box. And this will be the last video like this for Cyber Week because tomorrow I have a come shopping with me. I'm going to brave Westfield and I'm going to go for it on actual Black Friday. So stay tuned for a real time come shopping with me tomorrow. And if you haven't already, please do subscribe and turn the notification bell on so you don't miss any upcoming content. After this week, it's going to go back to normal and there is going to be my version of Vlogmas coming your way very soon. Okay, so the two main retailers that I got very excited about this morning were And Other Stories and H&M. So I'm going to show you a few of my top picks from each of those retailers. And Other Stories for me is a fantastic one for those basic pieces that you're going to get a lot of repeat wear out of. That is the aim this Black Friday. We don't want any impulse purchases. We don't want any things which you're going to wear a few times and then forget about or worse, leave the label on and just totally forget they even exist. So I've got a really lovely collection of the kind of pieces you'll get a lot of wear from and they are the best kinds of things to get in the sale. So this is a really gorgeous very simple jumper, it's got a high neck, it is a makeup magnet so I would say just kind of cleanse the neck area before you pop this on because let's just say mine is already looking a little bit tarnished but you can't see that when it's on so it doesn't hugely bother me. This is the kind of thing that I wear on repeat. It's a classic layering piece whether you're wearing it just under a coat with a nice scarf, um, you can wear a thermal underneath, you can really put as many layers with this as you want and because of the neutral colour and classic silhouette it literally is just a building block essential piece of your wardrobe so I definitely recommend picking this up now that And Other Stories is 30% off. If you want something a little bit more stylized, I guess you could say, this is just an absolute dream. So this is my jumper with the pearls on it. I wore this um, to film one of the previous videos this week and so many of you guys absolutely loved it. I have to say, teeny, teeny, tiny bit itchy, so if you are sensitive to that, then it's probably one to avoid, but the way that I get around that, I, it doesn't bother me that much, but I just wear a long sleeve thermal, I'll leave my favourite thermal top link down below. Thermals don't just keep you warm, by the way, they temperature regulate you, so just generally the best thing you can wear as an underlayer. I love the pearl detail on this, slightly ballooning sleeves as well, um, and it's just a really easy to wear knit, but one that's a little bit more statement than the example that I showed you earlier. If you love pearls but want something a little bit softer and lighter, then this is a really gorgeous one. If I show you up close, you can see it's got like a diamond detail to it, and then little pearls like embroidered 
into the fabric which is so so pretty. This one is a lot more of a lightweight knit than the one that I previously showed you so perhaps one to wear into work. This with a pair of, oh my goodness, this with a pair of white tailored trousers with a brown belt, maybe the brown Gucci belt. I'll link that in the sale down below as well. That would be such a nice office wear outfit. I personally have been wearing this with midi skirts and I love how they look together with my gold headband as well. That's a real go-to look for me. Um, in fact, I'll pop a picture on the screen here. The tool skirt is also from And Other Stories, but I would definitely recommend getting a slip for underneath it. Check out Tuesday's ASOS haul for my slip recommendation and also the ASOS sale has officially launched so I will leave my ASOS haul linked up here if you'd like some inspo on what to pick from the ASOS sale and all the discount codes you need for that. Regular subscribers will know um, I have a lot of coats, a lot of coats and I don't need any more but I have to say and other stories do coats very well indeed and I spotted this one and I thought it'd be a fabulous one to show you if you are yet to buy your winter coat and are looking for something like this because because it is a real classic. Things that I love about this, firstly, the quality. It's so soft, it's wool, so it's really lovely and warm and temperature regulating. You've got the lining as well. The material is really, really high quality. The silhouette is absolutely gorgeous. It is a robe style, so you can cinch it in around the waist or just wear it loose over the shoulders, no matter what kind of style you prefer, this coat can be perfect for that. I also like the smartness of the lapels, a little bit more of a smart silhouette, trench-like. And the colour, it's a really lovely neutral, which means it's so easy to style. Whether you've got a really feminine colour palette like mine with creams and pinks, it just works absolutely perfectly. If you see against the rail of clothes behind me, it blends in really well. But also, if you're much more um, chic than I am and you have more of a black and white and denim wardrobe, it's just so versatile. That's why I love this very light tan colour. And I also think this colour is so flattering on so many different skin tones. So this is one I would definitely re pick, recommend picking up. I just don't need it. It's so tempting for me to keep this, but oh, I just don't need another coat in my collection. And Other Stories really is fantastic for knitwear. I have just two more to show you and then we'll move on. This one is a new one that I picked up recently. It has got balloon sleeves, which is really the only design detail on this. Other than that, it's got a plain um, crew neck collar. Lovely soft material and definitely doesn't break the bank, especially with today's 30% off. So if you are a fan of slightly more cropped jumpers, you want something a bit more lightweight, with a really beautiful statement balloon sleeves, which is one of Winter's biggest trends then this is a gorgeous option and then this is actually one of my all-time favorite jumpers I wear this so much both um, nipping out to do errands I wear it when I'm lounging around the house and it still looks super smart as well it is actually um, can't tell too well in this lighting but it is actually a super light pink like a beautiful very light almost creamy blush pink shade and I find the neckline of this you can see it's got the low scoop I just find it so so flattering and again really affordable so great to pick up in today's sale I also picked up an accessory from um, and other stories and it is this headband I like to keep my head warm at this time of year and sometimes I find hats just a little bit too much they make it look as though you're really chilly whereas a headband is a really nice in-between. I love the crisscross style on this. I would put it on now but I think it might ruin my hair so I'll probably film a little try-on clip for you but this has got metallic thread running through and it's a beautiful kind of OT beige colour so I thought that would be... <laughs> <laughs> Looks like a Jojo Siwa bow. Um, I thought that would be a really nice option. Keeping me toasty when I'm watching the rugby or walking around when it's chilly. So yeah, very pleased with this. I also find Another Story's jewellery is absolutely gorgeous. Especially if you're more looking towards a high street price tag than a premium price tag like the one that I'm wearing here. I do have to say they are pretty darn similar. Obviously the quality of this is another level. This is rose gold whereas this is yellow gold but I just couldn't resist showing this to you. So if you're on the lookout for a chain necklace and I love the um, coin pendant on this one. If you look on this side actually like a Roman coin and it's got a T-bar fastening whereas this one you can open and close and add pendants wherever you want. But of course the end of the stories is a fraction of the price so if you are looking to add a chain necklace to your wardrobe in a very affordable way then this is a gorgeous option. Also with the chain jewellery they have this really Really beautiful, not sure where the focus is best, um, chain bracelet and I love pearl jewellery and when pearls 
are mixed in with a slightly, I would say a slightly more masculine chain style bracelet. I think that's a really lovely combination. So here you've got a little pearl and a metal pendant too. This is classic timeless jewellery, so it's a really good time to invest in things like this because you can wear them all year round, so you might as well make the most of the discount. And if there's one thing I don't need, it's another pair of pearl earrings, but I couldn't resist. These are so gorgeous. I loved the mix of the hoop style and the pearl trend, two of my favourite earring trends in one, so I thought these were really gorgeous. Gorgeous. A decent size hoop that it makes a statement without being um, too bling, if you know what I mean. I find big hoops a little bit blingy, not really my style, but I love these and I think they're so feminine with the pearls inside. Okay, and moving on to H&M, and I really am going to whiz through these because I'm conscious that we do have the Come Online Shopping With Me at the end of this video. I'm going to show you a few things from previous hauls and hopefully they'll still be in stock. So as you know, I fell in love with the dress version of this. It is the tall skirt with the polka dots and as soon as I saw the skirt come online, I was like, yes, need to add that to my collection. I'm loving tulle skirts at the moment. I find them so elegant and feminine and gorgeous to wear with a chunky knit at this time of year. And I don't wear much black, but I saw it also in black and I love the sheer fabric with the polka dots. So I thought if there's any black skirt that is gonna work for my wardrobe, it's gonna be this one. Speaking of chunky knits with tulle skirts, this is my fave from H&M. As I just mentioned, I love pearl details. I'm so glad they're so on trend at the moment. And this is a classic, very classic chunky knit. Don't worry, I don't normally store it on this hanger. And it's just got this pearl detail on the neckline for some reason. Even though this is right up on my face, I've not noticed this picking up makeup as much as the Under the Stories jumper. Couldn't resist, couldn't resist, darlings. I picked up a Christmas jumper from um, H&M. I just thought the little reindeers were so cute and I love this almost grandpa chic style. So I thought this would be a really nice one that's not like overly cheesy and festive, it's just kind of alpine chic, cute festive. That's a nice one to add to your basket while well, they've got 30% off. So these next few pieces are from my most recent H&M order. First of all, there goes the sun, but quite on topic because the next thing I have to share with you is a big chunky wool coat. Again, not one that I'm going to be keeping because I have got far too many, I've got enough coats to last a lifetime. And on that note, by the way, as the temperatures start to drop, if you do have any coats that you no longer need, no longer wear, it's a really good idea to give them to any homeless people that live near you. Um, especially puffer jackets, even if they've got rips on them, things like that, it is very much appreciated and could, in fact, save a life if you give old coats to the homeless at this time of year, just some food for thought. So this, similarly to the and other stories, is the robe style silhouette. You can cinch it in the waist or wear it loose and then you do have the lapel detail. Slightly lighter in colour, but again it is lined and a really good affordable option if you do want a very classic coat, something that is going to look very classic and timeless and something that you will wear year after year after year, a really good investment piece that doesn't cost a huge amount of money. I may have a bit of a problem because I also <laughs> picked up another knit with pearls on it, but girls, you can never have too many pearly knits, especially if you are obsessed with pearls as much as I am. This one has the most gorgeous pearl detail on the sleeves, but it really is quite subtle. So it just, you know, if they catch the light or catch someone's eye, it's a really nice little surprise detail. But otherwise, it's a super plain, chunky jumper, and we all know already how classic and versatile they are. So definitely, definitely, definitely pick this one up. If you're on the lookout for a sparkly number for your Christmas party or New Year's Eve, then, oh, I mean, look at this. Look at how it catches the light. Can you imagine under a disco light or under the fireworks? Absolutely gorgeous and doesn't even need to be said that the colour is just an absolute dream. I don't know, I might replace the belt. I thought this was going to be that really horrible like stripey ribbon but it's actually more of a satin ribbon. It's probably worth running your straighteners over this once you've done your bow just to give it a really polished finish because as you can see it does have creases on the bow which is not a good look, but beautiful, almost rose gold, pinky sequins, low plunge neck. It is very short, so if you are tall, maybe one to um, reconsider, but I think it's just absolutely gorgeous. And if you're going partying, then why not show a little bit of a leg? You guys know I love a good dupe, and H&M, as well as Zara, is one of the places that I frequent when it comes to looking for dupes. I am obsessed with the Zimmerman um, Super 8, is that what it's called, Super 8, collection, and especially this blouse. I have got that firmly on my wish list, or I did, until 
I saw this, which, oh my goodness, it is such a good dupe and a far nicer price tag, especially with a 30% off. It even has the almost kind of pirate style of detail on the sleeves, where you've got a big Victorian cuff and all the buttons, open detail on the blouse. It does have a little vest top within it, so it's not going to be too revealing. And then this beautiful ruffled neckline. I absolutely love this, and it's definitely going to be the kind of thing that I'll be wearing all through spring and summer as well, already thinking about those sunnier days but I did some Instagram stories with swipe ups to shop this collection this morning so I would be very snappy if you want to add this to your basket because these things tend to sell out when I mention them on my Instagram stories. Another thing that no winter wardrobe is complete without is a classic cable knit, a really chunky cable knit jumper, and that's exactly what this is. It is so lovely and soft. I really love the big scooping neck. You can really get totally bundled up with this. This with a pair of brown leather leggings and my moon boots. Oh my god, that would be such a gorgeous ski chic look. Definitely need to layer up my thermal underneath this for upcoming ski trips. Don't have one booked, but I definitely want to. Freddie and I are trying to get away in December because we fell so in love with Majev last year and we just want to do another alpine retreat together so this would be absolutely gorgeous for that and also just being super cozy and warm here at home. Someone call the pearl police because I've done it again. <laughs> another jumper. But when they are this cute and so classic how could I possibly resist? This actually looks like a far more expensive jumper and especially with 30% off how was I supposed to leave this really it is just the most me jumper ever I love this detail around the neckline you got the big pearls and the little pearls in this beautiful kind of bashing out detail it's just stunning once again I'll wear this with my high-waisted midi skirts but you could wear it to work you could smarten it up you could even wear it with a pair of jeans so versatile so gorgeous and so soft as well let's have a look what material this is polyamide and wool so it's actually not surprising that it's so soft because it does have wool in the fabric mix so it's gonna keep you nice and toasty warm as well practical and pretty and this is the final clothing piece from H&M I do have a couple of very random things to share with you after this but it is a sparkly vest top because again really great for party season you could wear this under a blouse or you could wear it with um, hmm. <laughs> you could wear it with the sparkly sequin skirt from Topshop if you really want which is still available and 25% off if you want a very jazzy outfit or you could wear it with a wool midi skirt or any kind of midi skirt you could wear it with jeans if you are jeans and a nice top kind of gal for your festive party plans that would be this would be an amazing option I'll probably pair this with leather leggings maybe my cream ones um, my 1999 faux leather leggings from Zara would look rather gorgeous with this and a pair of heels and Bob's your uncle. And the two random things to finish because the 30% off also extends to H&M Home um, shower curtain because did you know you should wash your shower curtain once a week because obviously it gets damp and bacteria grows on it. I think I found that out in a YouTube clip from this morning about like where in your home has the most bacteria. <gasps> so I thought I would treat myself and the house to a new um, shower curtain. This one's got little gold star details on it. And lastly from H&M I picked up a set of these cushion seat cushions. I have um, wooden chairs in the house at the dining table. Yes if I spill food on these they are going to stain but hopefully they can go in the washing machine. Yeah you can wash this at 40 degrees. That's music to my ears. I thought these were just gorgeous and a really nice way of making my dining experience more comfortable and also a little bit of a booster seat because I do find that I go and grab a cushion um, from the sofa to sit on when we're eating because I like to be a little bit higher so hopefully I won't need to with this. The only thing that they could have done is put little ribbons on so you can actually attach them to your chair if needs be but you can always attach those really easily yourself and it's this kind of champagne-y silver colour which is so lovely. So that's everything that I wanted to share with you in real life physical product wise but I do want to do a come online shopping with me so join me with a cup of coffee and your laptop and let's do some online shopping Okay darlings, so I'm basically going to get started by clicking the link in my description box because that's going to take me to the Black Friday hub on my blog. And here I can see all of the discounts that have gone live today. It's updated every single day so already it's got today's best discounts. They're all linked down below but I know that I want to get something really special, something from the luxury side of things. So I'm going to click here to go to my blog homepage. And then the second most recent post is the best luxury discounts this Black Friday. So I'm clicking on that. 
because every single retailer has got so many um, things in the sale. If we have a look at the seasonal edit on Net-A-Porter, you can see there are 233 pages of products. And I don't know about you, but I do not have time for that. So luckily, what I've done for you guys, I've spent hours doing this, is create an edit of all the best products. So for example, my Jimmy Choo shoes, which I love. My, oh, oh my gosh, these are on my wish list. I'm going to add those to a new tab. The Max Mara coat that I wanted, still out of my price range, but I did want to treat myself to a fabulous new pair of headphones. And I think these Bang & Olufsen ones are amazing. But there's so many great things here. The Castagna wedges, so classic. Um, workout clothing, I think that's amazing. Buy far sandals, my peony swimsuit, so many amazing things in the Netta Porter sale. Love those as well. And then from Selfridges, Selfridges and Netta Porter, they are definitely the best two, I would say. Valentino, the classic rock studs, my Chloe Abbey bag, oh my goodness. Even the steamer that I just got for my birthday and the new GHD rose gold set, Selfridges sale is so, so good. And then because I know you guys love Stuart Whiteson boots as much as I do, they're such a good investment. I've actually linked all of my favorites here and I've done an entire blog post on where to buy Stuart Whiteson boots this Black Friday. So this has got loads and loads of different um, boot options. And then Farfetch, it's got my new Chloe jumper, 30% off. Let's see, oh, the new Chloe coat is so gorgeous. Miss Sony Castagna wedges, more Chloe bags, Zimmerman dress that I had my eye on for a while. So, so good. So what I'm going to do now is go to the retailers. Oh, that's the big page. The Jimmy Choo boots. Oh, they are selling out so quickly. Oh my goodness, luckily my size is still there. <gasps> Unavailable. Oh my God. Oh no. Don't say that. Come on. <gasps> okay, I'm going to keep trying. Have faith. Okay, the headphones are still in stock. Add to shopping basket. Can you imagine trying to run around the shops? This would just take hours. Come on. Please, 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 please. Yes, amazing. Yes, I do have six things in my net porter basket. Um, okay, we've done that. That's the net porter basket. Stuart Weissman boots. Chloe coat. Oh, you're so beautiful. 25% off. I mean, it is a lot of money for a coat. And oh my gosh. My size is 400 pounds more expensive than other... No, I'm sorry. No, that's too much. Okay, let's go back to the blog. Back to the main page. And now I'm going to go and have a look at High Street. So it's down here. The best Black Friday 2019 High Street sales. Can't keep up with these. Luckily, you guys don't have to because this page is just going to be updated all the time. I've already done my Topshop order. River Island, you can get the... Uh, snowflake jumper that I love, my boots that I featured in my latest Instagram, some really nice classic, oh, jumper dress, okay, I need to add this, please, still be in stock, let's go back to the blog post, do I need a code, yes, 20 off, okay, I'm gonna get this, ooh, I'm gonna get some extra small, love that, okay, back to the blog, H&M, I've already done my order, but, oh my gosh, these things, classic cable knit, classic coat, this is the best Zimmerman dupe. Oh my goodness, it's so good. All my picks here. Mango, I did want to choose this dress while they've got their 30% off for my um, upcoming Christmas event that I've got to go to. Ted Baker sale is so good. Oh my goodness, from like classic coats, 30% off. I love that everyone's doing 30% off this year as opposed to like 20% off. Monica Vinader, yes, I really wanted to get this um, coin pendant. They've got 30% off and flash sales going on as well. Kate Spade, I already did my Kate Spade order, it's so good. And Sweaty Betty, oh my gosh, so Sweaty Betty is where all of my gym stuff is from. 25% off everything. You can never have too many Sweaty Betty gym socks either, so I'll be topping up on those. And then what else do we want to look at? Um, let's have a look, ooh, okay, John Lewis. So they have got the most practical things up to 50% off. Lizelle Cleanse and Polish, classic, I use that every single day. iPhones, makeup pans they've got everything so good um and then of course i have my daily edit to check out as well guys my blog is literally blackfriday.com right now <laughs> so these are the best sales particularly for today and other stories so exciting uh what else have we got cos by terry oh let's have a look at by terry as well so this is basically my method um if you want the absolute creme de la creme 
then I'd recommend going on the Daily Picks blog post and looking at today's top sale picks because it's got all of my favorites and all the things I will most likely be buying. Don't forget to sign up to my newsletter because that's also the best place to look for the sales that are going live. This is what it looks like. And yes, of course, for tomorrow, actual Black Friday, it's going to be a massive bumper edition with everything and an edit of the best products to make it so easy for you. So I'm going to go and do my checking out. I will have a little browse before checking out because it seems silly to only buy one thing. Um, but that's very boring. This is the Zimmerman dupe. How amazing is that? So yeah, I'm going to add everything to my basket and do my checkouts. So I hope you enjoyed coming online shopping with me. As you can see, I'm very efficient. <laughs> okay, back to the video. All right, darlings, so that is it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed coming online shopping with me and seeing all of the gorgeous bits that we have picked up recently and that are reduced in the Black Friday sales. As I mentioned, tomorrow, which is the actual Black Friday, I feel like it's just been a whole week of Black Fridays, I'll be doing a real-time come shopping with me. So I'll be taking you along to Westfield. I'll be explaining my reasons why. Um, but please don't miss out on any sales and discount codes. Please sign up to my newsletter so that at 8 a.m. when the sales go live, you'll be the first to know the very best sales of actual Black Friday because so many retailers will be either bumping up their discounts or new retailers will be adding new discounts or product categories might be um, increased discount like Monica Vinader increased their rose gold from 30 to 40% off. So make sure you look out in your inbox for my newsletter tomorrow and of course the Black Friday hub on my blog but you already know that. <laughs> so that is all from me darlings. Thank you for watching. Thank you for sticking with me this week. I'm so glad you've been finding it useful. I've been loving your feedback. Thank you so much. And that's all from me for today. See you tomorrow for Black Friday. Happy shopping and good luck. <laughs>